Security Guard Bones here, and we're back with our Jedi Knight playthrough. I'm already here on Nar Shada, so yeah, let's just get started. General, I've arrived on Nar Shada. Still no word from Agent Galen? Negative. After Terrace and Ord Mantell, I fear the worst. I'll warn you now, the project there is... I should have ended it years ago. Conversations like this never end well. After the Empire's victory on Coruscant during the war, people were terrified. We looked weak, helpless. The Senate authorized research into science we had no business exploring, using technology to turn ordinary men into living weapons. The Power Guard program was creating the ultimate soldier, one tough enough to fight a Sith head-on. The best defense against a Sith is someone like me. Your order was nearly extinct. The Senate feared you might never recover. Nar Shada has the latest advances in cybernetics, combat adrenals, personal armor, and weapons. Everything we need to create the Power Guards. There's also a distinct lack of government oversight. You're in hot territory, neutral space. Laws are practically non-existent. It's my first visit to hot space. What do you know about them? Huts break laws just breathing, but they let us do our business, no questions asked. I placed a single operative in charge of the Power Guard project. Gave him unlimited authority and enough credits to fund the program. The research facility operates in absolute secrecy. I don't even know where it is. Darth Angrel's henchman on Coruscant said all our research facilities were compromised. Our operative's name and contact data were in the file stolen on Coruscant. Our operative has disappeared, and Agent Galen vanished trying to find him. I can only assume they're dead or captured. If they're alive, I'll save them. But what about the weapons project? Our research can die for all I care. I need you to coordinate with the Strategic Information Service branch on Nar Shada. The Bureau Chief's name is Raikin. SIS headquarters is hidden on the promenade. You'll visit a merchant shop and use a secret turbo lift in the back to meet with Raikin. Promenade, shop, secret turbo lift. Got it. <laughs> I feel like a spy already. Transmitting the location coordinates and turbo lift security code to you. Good luck. Varsuthra, out. Alrighty. Oh, there we go. Nar Shada. I actually like Nar Shada. I know a lot of people don't like it because of the uh, kind of confusing or uh, inconvenient map areas. Like it's kind of compact and the roads are filled with mobs so you always get dismounted when they shoot at you. It's kind of annoying. Fix that bug with the uh, dies. Yeah, I'm still on checks. It. I have. N I still have no idea how to unify <laughs> the uh, companion armor sets or you know, companion armor outfits. Like on my other characters, the my companions already have their outfits unified, so I don't need to change them or anything, but with like new characters, I can't unify their outfits. Colors, so that is not very good. Unless I'm missing something, which I might be. Yeah, all I can all I see is this this unify option here, but it just it doesn't work. So I kind of had to make Kira's outfit with other pieces that kind of matched color-wise. Because I had a, a different outfit planned for her. Still similar, but they're like different color. Alright, here we are. Welcome. Please select an available travel route. Like, I just like the background environment for this map, it's so cool. I wish I could just fly around. Promenade. 
And I think that new vendor is here too. Uh, you can buy like You're reputation fine. tokens. What is it called? The underworld tokens or something? Yeah, underworld syndicate plans. I'm actually not sure what the reputation is used for. Like if there's another vendor that you can buy stuff from with the by getting the right reputation. I don't know. As new. Raiken. That's the second field agent who's missed a check in. Our network's under attack. We don't know that. We know Agent Galen was captured. He's telling the enemy where to hit us. If it makes you feel better, transmit alert level Omega to all field agents. See how many respond. The Jedi who eliminated Watcher One. Glad to meet you. I'm Bureau Chief Riken. Wish I had better news to report. We're fumbling in the dark right now. Lighting up the darkness is one of my specialties. Here's what little I know. Agent Galen came here to secure a top-secret operation. Something hidden even from us. Galen disappeared in the Nikto sector while pursuing a contact. Fortunately, he left a trail we can follow. It's a start. How do I pick up this trail? Galen left coded progress reports at SIS dead drops all over the Nikto sector. Unfortunately, that whole area's gone hostile. Had to pull my agents out. You want those reports? You'll have to go in alone. Thank goodness. For a second, I thought this might be too easy. I sent the Omega alert. Only half our field agents responded. I'm telling you we're compromised. We need to move this headquarters before it's too late. Darth Angrel is clearly targeting the SIS. Time to move. We'll wipe the computers and leave Nar Shaddaa. Evacuating this facility is out of the question. We're safe here, and we have a mission to complete. I've marked the locations of Agent Galen's dead drops. Download his messages to your holo and contact me. I'll decode them. Let's get some answers. Good luck. Yeah, I'd at least move, like, buildings if I were him. Or just move to a different area of the planet. But I guess, then again, it might not matter. If they already know where they are, they can just track them easily. Man, you've probably got, like, the best hackers on... Or slicers on Arshada, so... Empire could probably just hire them to find them.
I'll probably be like level 60 or 65 by the time I'm done with the, the main storyline here. Just gonna try and pass as many of these guys as we can. There, good as n Another Jedi. You're fine. Last one. Oh, uh, yeah. Let's just go back over here. Might be faster. Might not be able to skip these guys. We'll see. Hey, I guess we can. Probably gonna have to take care of these guys, though. I've downloaded all of Agent Galen's coded messages. Transmitting a decryption signal to your holo? The scrambling? Hmm. Times and locations, standard tracking details. And one priority holo. Playing that back now. Found our lead operative. Dead. He'd been tortured. The power guard data files are missing. No clues to the main facility's location, but there was evidence of a recruitment center here. The project was using refugees as test subjects. The recruitment center's my best shot at finding the main facility. I'm going in. Leaving the site's coordinates just in case. Galen out. Took guts going in there alone. Not sure what's worse. The enemy stealing our weapons project, or us experimenting on refugees. I'm shocked General Varsuthra permitted illegal testing. With all the layers of secrecy, he probably didn't know. Agent Galen, or whoever got him, holds the key to recovering the Power Guard project. The trail ends at that recruitment center. You need to get inside there, find out what's happened. Good luck, Raikonaut. All right. Ah, oh, it's just up there. I thought we had to go to another place.
It'll be all right. I'm here to help. Chief Riken, the recruitment center was overrun with Imperials. No sign of Agent Galen, but I've just freed some refugees. Not refugees. Heroes. These people put their lives on the line for victory over the Empire. Name's Velnarok. Been recruiting volunteers for the Power Guard project since it started. Those people asked to become test subjects? The Empire stole their homeworlds. They jumped at the chance for payback. Over the years, hundreds of people volunteered for the Power Guard experiments. Heroes. All of them. How many Power Guards are there? What are they like? That's way above my security level. But I've heard they're amazing. Even stronger than a Jedi. Don't know how the Empire found us. But they control the whole project now. Tell me where the Power Guard experiments take place. Never seen the main lab, but it's someplace in the red light sector. Imperials are sending people there for... testing. That's one of the busiest parts of Nar Shadda. We'll never find the lab. I've heard it's the only building with a dedicated energy reactor. Does that help? Absolutely. Contact me when you're in the red light sector. I'll have a plan. Riken out. I'll get these volunteers to safety. I hope you kill every last one of those Imperials. Light sector, eh? Uh, let's just uh, quick travel real quick. It's like we go to the red light sector and just forget about our mission and spend all our credits on the twilight healing baths. Okay, that was weird. This place looks a little bit different than I remember, but nah, it's just, just me. Are you deaf? I asked for Iridonian hearts, not Rodian, not Ithorian, Iridonian. What do you want me to do? Put them back? I'm in the red light sector. You have a plan for finding that main lab? If the power guard facility has a dedicated reactor, it's immune to energy fluctuations affecting the power grid. My team is monitoring energy readings in that sector. All you have to do is cause some fluctuations. Applying a lightsaber to the right power conduits ought to do the trick. I assume you have some targets in mind. Sending coordinates to key power conduits. Hit them all, and we'll get a fix on that power guard main lab. And be careful. The red light sector may look civilized, but it's nothing of the sort. Riken out. That was funny, you could still hear those two guys talking in the middle of the conversation. Oof, there are more areas to explore around here. Oh, whoops. Uh, oh no, I'm right. I have to go up here first. Uh, nope, 
right up here. Oh, never mind. <laughs> yeah, I guess I don't know where I'm going, even though I've done this so many times. You're fine. Too bad you can't have all three gathering skills at the same time. Well, actually you can, but, uh... I'm thinking about crafting skills. Throw him. Only one building in the sector maintained a steady energy supply when you disrupted those power conduits. That has to be the main lab. Sending coordinates now. Aside from Agent Galen and the test subjects, we have no idea what you'll face in there. How will you play this? I'll give the enemy an opportunity to surrender. If they don't take it, that's their problem. With luck, you'll catch the opposition off guard. You're in for a hell of a fight. Here goes nothing. Contact me when it's done. Riken out. Oh, it's on the, side, uh, the other side. Uh, I'll just... I'll just fly there. Usually, on a lot of my new characters that I make, I just have nothing but gathering skills, but I don't have an arms tech, so I thought it would make sense for the Mandalorian to be the weaponsmith.
There they are. We've been waiting for you, Jedi. Darth Angrel told me you defeated Watcher One and Inquisitor Farav. Impressive. Explains why you're not here. Scared, huh? Even my Padawan is laughing at you. You must be so embarrassed. You killed good men at that recruitment center. Loyal soldiers. The best. They served evil. The galaxy won't miss them. No one will miss you, either. I promised Commander Grawl he could execute you personally. And I left him a few gifts to help. Mark I power guards, not as destructive as the later models I possess, but quick to assemble and quite malleable. It took nothing to wipe their useless minds and program them to serve me. Twisted. What have you done to these people? Perfected them. What good is a weapon you can't control? They were only aliens. Not as if their minds mattered. Kill the Jedi. Cut out the Padawan's tongue and bring it to me. I don't think so. Power guards didn't even get a chance to attack. Well, that's that. Too late, Riken. Darth Angrel's apprentice raided the lab. There's nothing left here. I found an encrypted data pad on an Imperial officer. Looks important. It may have information on where the enemies moved to. Bring the data pad back to headquarters. My slicers will crack the decryption. We'll have to move fast to stop the enemy. Hurry. All right. Turn to the chief. So that one Imperial back there. It's like, oh, what happened? Why is everyone dead? I think after I uh, finish all the story and stuff on this character, I want to try and 100% each planet, get all the lore objects and holocrons and stuff. Probably take a while, but something to do. At least the Mark II got a couple hits in. <laughs> I told Raikin this base was compromised. The chief's dead. They're all dead. Wh what were those things? They're like what I fought at the main lab, but more powerful. You kept us out of the loop, hid the power guard facility, never told us about these weapons. We stayed, supported your mission when we should have evacuated. These deaths are on you. I agreed with you about evacuating. Your superior overruled us. He was incompetent. I should have been in charge months ago. With Raikin dead, I'm acting bureau chief. This operation's over. Agent Diaz, we're leaving now. Sorry, friend, but you're on your own. 
Chief Riken promised to unlock these Imperial files. Then take it up with him. His body's over there. Wait a minute, this Jedi is the only person who can stop those things. I gave you an order, Agent. And I lost my hearing during the fight. Give me the data pad. I'll do my best. Decryption complete. The enemy took everything from the power guard lab to a fallback position. I recognize these coordinates. An Imperial controlled factory on the industrial level. I couldn't have done this without your help. Make those scum pay for what they did to us. You have your information. The rest is up to you. This is a chance to strike back at the people who killed your men. I have no intention of winding up like them. Sir, I recommend we inform General Varsuthra. We need immediate reinforcements. I've marked the enemy's fallback position. Good luck down there. Let's go, Agent Diaz. All right. quest on this planet for this planet uh, for the storyline anyways vehicle pads are currently open for business could be one more action have a safe this. and pleasant stay kind of surprised at how fast I'm getting through this one But then again, I'm not doing any uh, like side quests or anything, so I guess it's not that surprising. this part see if I can It'd be even funnier if there was like a, a mount where you're hiding under a box. You're fine. Just go all Metal Gear Solid. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
might as well complete the bonus mission. his control over you. I promise. Too late. He's here. Nothing more irritating than a Jedi who won't die. Your constant interruptions must end. Your former ally will be your executioner. The new Agent Galen's power is matched only by his obedience. Face me yourself, or are you scared you'll wind up like Tarnas? Tarnas was a child, like you, beneath me. Galen? Destroy my enemy. No, I'd rather die. Control factor six initiated. <coughs> Neural override complete. Launching elimination protocol. Target, Jedi. I told you, he always wins. I'm trying to order 66 me. you from the Sith control. You can't remove the machines without killing me. But I don't matter anymore. The Sith Lord, Lord Static, has the Republic's Mark III power guards, cybernetically enhanced soldiers armed with advanced weapons. Static plans to build hundreds more, all controlled by him, an army to conquer Nar Shaddaa. I doubt the locals will lay down without a fight. The Huts are cowards. In the end, they'll surrender to save their fat eyes. Static's building his army in Shadow Town. An imperial controlled sector. Nastiest people on Nar Shaddaa. And that's saying a lot. I'll give you the coordinates. Ah! Neural override for starting. There's nothing else to do. Kill me. No. There must be a way to free you. Give me time to defeat Sadik. Free me? From this? Even without Sadik controlling me, I won't live like this. Hold on, Galen. We need to face Sadik together. We're the only people who can bring him to justice for what he's done. Are you with me? I don't know how long I can resist his commands, but I'll try. Safer if we don't travel together, just in case. I'll meet you inside Sadik's base in Shadowtown. Hurry. We don't have much time. Oh, oh, so that's what the burning was. <laughs> I can lie, it's it kind of annoying during the combo. <laughs> Just hear the freaking birdie. Alright, quick travel. Yeah, so it was right there. There's another one after this. Another mission. A sharp turn. <laughs> Shh. 
Shadow Town. You're fine. Uh, yeah, I think this is the place that's kind of annoying to get through. over there. Uh, it's one of those spider tanks. Kinda wish they made Umbara an explorable planet instead of just like a, a one-time flashpoint area. That'd be so cool. Uh, yeah, I think we go this way. <laughs> Alright, I guess we ain't skipping them. Got some help. a juggernaut. I think he's still a... Uh... Yeah, he's still a uh, Jedi. Sometimes it can be confusing with the <laughs> class titles. But he had Kira with him, so that's how you can tell. Like I said, I really regret uh, choosing Shadow for his secondary. Ah, I really wanted to pick, like, maybe a Marauder or something. Or no, not Marauder, but, um, uh, a Sat Sith Assassin. You'll live. Yeah. Mark 3. Those are Mark 3s, should have stuck with the Mark 2s. Think they were better. You're strong to have made it this far. Steroids. Strong enough. I am more than Sith now. Much more. He's tall. I'll give him that. Remarkable technology. So versatile. I just calculated 17 different ways to end your life. All that hardware won't save you from me. I've run the numbers. You overestimate your chances. A shame you'll never understand what true power feels like. Perhaps I'll add you to my army after all. Darth Angrel would appreciate that. No. We'll kill you first. Agent Galen, still functional? Let me rectify that. Control Factor 10 initiated. <coughs> Obey me, or I'll tear your mind apart. Keep him busy, Agent. I'll do the rest. <laughs> Poor Galen. <laughs> Keep him busy. <laughs> in the corner dying. Just do your thing, Galen. Oh. 
Sith using wrist blasters to shame. Oh, these guys finally showed up. Don't look so surprised. It's our job to follow people. Agent Diaz planted a tracker on you back at headquarters. Standard operating procedure. No offense intended. Would have been here sooner, but getting into Imperial territory without a lightsaber is complicated. Glad I don't have to hold this base by myself. We won't be staying long. This is Black Star Squad, a special operations team. General Varsuthra pulled in a favor with General Garza. Got him here quick. We're demolishing this location. Make sure the enemy can't recover anything useful. Good. I'll stay and die with this place. Galen? You've... changed. I'm dangerous. I should be destroyed. Inside, you're the same man you've always been. A hero. The SIS looks after its own, Galen. We'll help you. Just get me out of here. Lieutenant, prep this man for extraction. Sir, I've located the Power Guard files, including notes on how the Sith controlled them. Orders? That technology is too horrible to exist. Erase the data. I disagree, but I'm ready to be done with this. Go ahead, Agent Diaz. You should check in with General Varsuthra. We'll be right behind you. Just need to plant the incendiary charges. It was interesting working with you. Good luck. Mm, maybe I should have picked the sabotage option. Oh, well, too late to go back. I mean, I could have canceled the conversation, but nah. I usually don't like doing that. I'll just stick with whatever choices I make. We narrowly escaped a major disaster, General. But a lot of good people died. Chief Raikin and his agents are a terrible loss. What happened to Galen? Well, at least he's alive. This turned from Special Agent Tander. His team eradicated all trace of what happened at that Sith base. Thank you for destroying the Power Guard files. Approving that project was the biggest mistake of my career. Never let fear compromise your ideals. If only it were that simple. The Republic's position on Nar Shaddaa is precarious at best. Better for everyone if this operation remains classified. I'm sealing all records of what happened here. You, me, and the SIS are the only ones who know the full story. If anyone else confronts me about this, I won't lie for you. I'm not asking you to lie. Just use some discretion. I know you're probably exhausted, but the enemy hasn't given up. Neither can we. A major tactical advantage has just opened up, but you have to act quickly. One of Darth Angro's closest advisors, Admiral Hacklin, asked us for asylum. He wants to defect. Hacklin was with Angro when he interrogated me on Ord Mantell. They seemed chummy. What changed? I'm not sure, but the Admiral is on the run. There are unconfirmed reports Hacklin's earned a death mark. One of Darth Angrel's top men turned traitor? It's too convenient. Exactly. This is obviously a trap. Hacklin wouldn't be the first high-ranking Imperial to switch sides. Until we know otherwise, we have to believe this is real. Fira obviously made an impression on the Admiral at Ord Mantell. He says he'll only surrender to her. I have a bad feeling about this. There's no time to negotiate. Admiral Hacklin's expecting you to, and no one else. I told him to wait for you at an old asteroid mining facility. I'm uploading the coordinates now. We'll bring the Admiral in safely. Be careful out there. Alright, I think I'll save that for the uh, next part. Um, so, I guess I'm gonna end things off here. Well, 29. Thought I would be level 30, but nah, that's fine. Anyways, yeah, that's gonna end it for this part. Uh, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Bones out.